Right, so what is up guys, SDPZ here, and today we are finally back with another video. I'm very sorry it's been two weeks, I've just been kind of busy, uh, I'm like in the process of going back to work now, and it's been a bit wild, I'm sorry about that, but today we're going to be talking about, of course, as you can probably tell from the thumbnail, the recent hype of um, effectively female Twitch streamers hot tub streams, and it's become the new hype, it's all you see if you go on Twitch now, and we need to have a chat about it. So... Uh, if you weren't aware, if you literally, literally, if you just go on to Twitch nowadays, in fact, I'll probably do it right now and it will just prove my point. Do you know what? Let's do it. Right, so I'm on my Twitch here. If I literally just click um, here, if we go, look, immediately on the on the screen, we've got this girl. Uh, just immediately, this is the, one of the first ones that comes up. She's a, um, It's like an immediate hot tub stream. If you go into the just chatting section, um, look, one, there's another, uh, there's just... It's, look, another one here. They're just obviously they're more popular at night when more people are watching. But you know, it's a bit mad. It's a bit mad. It's taken over the platform. I mean, to just have a chat about that because I think it's a bit wild that that is taken over a platform, which is effectively meant for you. I, I understand the idea because obviously that is their way of creating their way and, and becoming their famous streamer that they want to achieve and becoming the person they want to achieve in life. They're doing their thing. You're like at the end of the day, you got to respect it. They're, they're, they're earning the bag. Like, I ain't being funny. Have you seen the donations that these girls are getting? These, the girl, the donations, the subs. It is ridiculous. People are blowing the fuck up on, on Twitch. Just effectively by being hot. So, effectively, the uh, Twitch Terms of Service, um, there's obviously a nudity thing, as there is with every pl social media platform. Uh, and the idea is that you cannot be effectively just in your underwear. Uh, obviously or just or effective nudity because obviously that is just not great for the platform It's not what they're aiming to do However, the problem is when you when you it comes to bathing suits and a pool there's a very very gray area. It's They're not in underwear. So and obviously if you go to a pool you will be wearing a bathing suit a bikini Along those lines. So it's very very difficult to like go You're breaking terms of service because technically they're not so obviously with this being a bit difficult to sort of police, they can't exactly ban people because if they ban one person, they've then got to ban every single person who is doing well on Twitch by these hot tub streams, which obviously they're going to cause a lot of controversy. Now, a lot of streamers have also had their say on this. Um, there's a very, been a very mixed reaction across the community um, because obviously, like I say, it's a difficult, it's a, it's a grey area topic. It's, it's all based on opinions effectively. You've got plenty, uh, streamers like uh, XQC that are saying that it, at the end of the day, like, it's, it's dodgy, it shouldn't be happening, but it's a grey area of the platform, so can they really police it? It's a bit difficult to do. You've On the other hand, you've got Valkyrie, who's streaming, saying uh, she clicked on some of their streams. At the end of the day, they're good-looking girls. They're earning their money. You don't have to subscribe. You don't have to donate. You don't have to follow, which is a fair point. Let them get on with their thing. And to be fair, like, that's a fair point. Like, you don't have to. I mean, but obviously we know... There's a lot of thirsty guys out there that are obviously going to subscribe to it, obviously going to donate, and that's how they're making their bag. Now, obviously, a lot of people find this slightly unfair because the people who are not necessarily going the right way about it, but you know what I mean, like playing games, actually chatting or showing their personality, not their personalities, um, that it's, it's considering obviously being a bit of a scummy way to do it because obviously people are, like, who are smaller trying to grow are just never going to make it unless effectively... Like, girl, especially girls who are streaming, they're just not going to make it unless you effectively just get your tits out or get your ass out, get yourself in a bikini, stick yourself in a pool, the men will come and watch because you've got your boobs out. Effectively, that is just what is what it is now. And obviously, that is obviously not what all people want to do. There's a lot of people who are find a, bit, a bit insecure about that or people who just they're just not interested in that being their content. But they're almost forced into it now based on they're just never going to grow unless they choose to basically do these like these new hot tub streams do i blame the girls that are doing this absolutely not at the end of the day if you're a girl and let's say you've got a nice nice pair of personalities you've got a nice behind you look your body's nice you're a good looking girl why would you not at the minute take advantage of this and make your bag get your donate make your money while you can before twitch put in some sort of rule that bans it i'm not being funny but why wouldn't you like, I, I completely rate anyone that's doing it. You're making the most of a good situation. 
and you're taking advantage of a trending topic and making your money fair play to you all honestly now do i think it's right probably not it's a bit harsh on other streamers obviously because like i say they're just never going to grow unless effectively you get naked and of course these are the streams are very sort of thirsty if you know what i mean like they'll have these like like a what let's say just here there'll be a whiteboard or a thing in the background where they put followers names or donators names but it's conveniently out of reach to just go like that and write on it they have to get up turn around and obviously expose certain areas that I imagine even more donations will lead to. It's very it's very manipulative and very clever, but it's also a bit dodgy and it's also a very grey area in the terms of service. I'm not sure I agree with it, um, but they're making their money. you got to give them credit. I just thought we should cover that topic, guys, because it's been a bit trending this week and I'd love to know your guys' opinions on it. Let me know your opinions down below and we've got an absolute banger of a video coming out uh, at the weekend, I'm not sure, quite sure when. I've, I've, it's all done. I just need to. The, the actual process of the video is done. I need to film it, uh, edit it, and upload it. Obviously, uh, it's, 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 uh, uh, yeah, it's a bit of a banger. I'm gonna give you a sneak peek at what it is. Um, it is, uh, it's a side men related video, uh, and it's, uh, it involves Tinder. So that's all I'm gonna give you. I'm not going to let you know exactly what the video is, but look forward to it because it's going to be sick. Let me know what you think of the new camera angle. It's slightly different now because I've changed up my setup. If you want to see an updated setup tour, then let me know that. But I'm, we are, me and Jade are actually on, uh, in the near future going to be moving into that room behind that wall, which is bigger than our current one. Uh, so I'll reset it up in there and then I'll do a setup tour for you guys. But let me know if you want to see that because it looks very different now. <laughs> like, it's kind of mad. Um, thank you very much for watching, guys. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. Sorry about the break uh, in uploads, but we'll be back. Don't worry. Thank you very much for watching. And peace.